love this music. That's Air Supply, who was announced as number 36 on the Billboard Hot 100 list of all-time top duos and groups. And guess what, friends? They're performing Friday here in San Diego. Lead singer Russell Hitchcock joining us this morning. Oh, I love your music. I love it. Thank you. Good morning. Welcome to San Diego. Thank you so much. We're looking forward to coming back. It's been a... Uh... Uh, a long time playing at Humphreys. We love the venue. It's gorgeous. We love having you here. How long have you been touring? Um, we've been touring for 48 years. Wow. Do you like it? Nonstop. Do you like it? Um, I love performing, uh, certainly. But as you all know, these days, traveling and hotels and cancellations and delays and stuff make it a giant pain. But uh, of course, when you get on stage, all that disappears. Um, I love my job and uh, I'm so grateful to be able to keep doing this after so many years and still have a lot of fans want to come and see us. Yeah, they want to come see you because we have like the best memories with the song. We fell in love with this music. You're known yep. very much for your love songs. I mean, like, yep. I can't tell you how many times I played those songs falling in love Good. and those little butterflies happening. But, but we, we started before you were born, though. No, well. Maybe, maybe, but look, <laughs> look, you like span across generations and even I like uh, awesome. jammed with that music. Where do you get the Good. inspiration from all these, the love songs? Well, my partner, Graham Russell, writes all the songs and uh, he's, he's, he, he won't uh, ever admit to what his inspiration is for a particular song. Okay. Uh, I do have know that he's a very observant guy. Um, he's always looking at people and, and especially couples, you know, what they seem to be feeling or what they seem to be doing. Um, and he's a softy, a romantic. Uh, he also writes poetry, so I think he's got that uh, sensitive, uh, you know, thing about him that I don't have. I just get to sing the songs. You just get to I'm happy sing. doing that. What is the most requested song when people, you know, shout, sing <clears throat> this, sing this? Um, it would be All Out of Love. It was, it was released in Australia first in 1978. All Out of Love? Yeah, and then uh, 1980, of course, but yeah. uh, it's the most requested song. We typically finish the show with it, and um, it's by far the most popular song we play. I'm all out of love. I'm so lost That's it, without babe. you. Yeah, I know that song very, very, very well. But you also have new music as well. Yes, we're working on it at an album. It's the first one we've done in 14 years, and uh, <clears throat> it was time. Uh, we're going to Canada in November to do some more vocals, and we hope that it will be out in the spring next year. Is this but, the song uh, you know, be, be Tough? Be Tough? Uh, that's that's one of them. Uh, but we're working on a whole bunch of things. Uh, but that's that's the first song that was released. Beautiful song, great message. Uh, and once again, I think it's another one of Graham's classics. And hopefully it, it'll get some exposure, uh, which has been obviously tough for us for quite a few years now. We used to be cool, but now we're not. No, you're still cool. Come on. I know we are. <laughs> <laughs> you know you are. Because when you go on tour and then you have your concert and you look out yeah, to yeah. the audience after you've oh, gotten yeah. all over the hotel stuff and whatnot, but you look and yeah. then there's people singing those words yeah. and they have it memorized. I have to imagine yeah. that, that that's it. That's what it's for. Well, it is. You know, it's one of the many things that we love about our job. In fact, uh, we, we've done a lot of work overseas and quite a few people tell us, especially in Asia, that they kind of learned English. Uh, oh. Not just from our songs, of course, but listening to our songs yeah. was a big help. So we know that we've, uh, we've touched a lot of people in a lot of countries and uh, we continue to do so. We're booked uh, on solidly on tour now till September next year. So things are as, as busy as they always have been and a little bit busier this year. Amazing. Well, we're excited to have you in San Diego. Air Supply Friday, 730 at Humphreys Concerts, by the way, uh, by the base. So good to see you. Thank you. Uh, I just I want to give a shout out to Frank and Jessica and uh, Mr. Krisky. I love those guys. We watch them every morning. Oh, well, thank you for getting that shout out. We look forward to having you in San Diego and we'll end with a little bit of Air Supply. We'll be right back. There you go. Have a great day.